Yo, what is good, my anniversary people? Let's get straight into it. This mech show is becoming a favorite of mine very quickly. And to see him actually go through this loss of a family who's already lost a son to something else and close to the same thing. It definitely sucks. And hopefully he does get to say something to them. And it doesn't take, you know, 20, 50 years for him to be able to do something like that. Um, but yeah, seeing someone apologize and do the work after trying to steal a tomato really does open your eye to his character. Not only that, you get to really get to see how hard it hits him to know that he has to leave. And it won't cause any more trouble. Just by leaving his shoes at the doorstep of this man's house, it gave him away clearly. And for that police officer to not say anything of that night, just kind of goes to show you the trust that they have. You've got to be hopeful that, you know, they weren't threatened into doing this. He's seeing how it's a terror, you know. Um, but yeah, it's, it's definitely a moving show. And it has its moments. So, he's already on his own besides the one, you know, mech that he has. And unfortunately, that mech is probably getting pretty annoying to <laughs> That mech partner, I should say. But yeah, I really do love what we're getting so far. It's kind of eye-opening to, uh, to see there's some really good character development in these mech animes because I would love to go back and watch a crap ton of them it's just they're so repetitive at times and some of the animation for the mechs aren't for me that I just kind of steer away from them but like I said Gundam Iron Blooded Orphans by far my favorite and I can see a lot of that show in this one just with the circumstances our main character is going through <clears throat> well yeah I uh, I'm really looking forward to this one. I can already feel it pull. I can already feel it pulling at my heartstrings, which is not a good sign. But regardless, I will push through. I will find a way to survive. And overall, I recommend it highly. I highly recommend it. It's entertaining. It had its ups and downs of him, you know, begging for apology. <laughs> you know, being a good kid. And, uh, as of right now, I don't know when this show is going to get even crazier, but to be on the run and to have to pretty much have people treat you like trash so they don't get in trouble just shows you how dire the situation is and how crazy things already are for him in the second episode. Well, that being said, I hope y'all have an amazing one. I gotta get all this stuff out on Twitter, Instagram, all that good stuff. So I'll definitely talk to y'all in the next one. I am your Pope, the Anime G. And I'll talk to you later. Hope you're having a good day, night, evening. Thank you for supporting, and I'll be back. Peace.